Who is Pack? Aha, we found it. Here we go. Translate. Oh, I found a battery. Ventilation power supply. Okay, so do we need to get rid of that to get in here? Ah, I see it. Yep. Let's see if there's anything else around here, though. Okay, we can't jump that far. Pack is AEW. Yeah, that, that's what I'm saying. Pack. That, that guy. My favorite wrestler in AEW is Pack. What are you, are you talking about? A AQA? Who are you talking about? <laughs> yeah, he's my favorite wrestler. But, but like, what song? What song does he have? I don't remember any other song he's had. Take this. I jump up here. What do we do? Drop it? Oh no, we drop ourselves. Uh oh. This always sounds like party forever. Whoa, 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 I messed up their boxes? No! What's going on here? I'm not doing this. I'm not doing this. I'm ruining everything. <laughs> Messing up their whole house. Haha, <laughs> nice! This is a cool way to open stuff. What about this? Something for here? Yeah, I know that pack, but like, I don't remember a Clementine song. Well, what? Clem oh! Can I drink this? Yeah, drink! A sip. It's just what the crowd or whatever is saying on a recent episode of Dark. Oh, I know what you're talking about. <laughs> yeah, that that uh, like the crowd chants. They had their, they had like a crowd chant that that was this like uh, this song that they like. They sing along together. What's this? Oh, that's the battery. Yeah, I remember. I don't remember how it goes, though. I'm just wrecking this dude's house. Whoa! Dude, I made it fly through the screen. I am a... I am a black hole. A black hole cat. Oh yeah, Pax. Yeah, that's it. That's it. Yes. Yes. That's what it was. It was to the tune of Clementine. I see. I see. I was like, that ain't how his theme goes. <laughs> Apparently it is to them, though. Yeah, they were singing it uh, when he was in that... Oh, whoa. Did we find the outside? No, it's just lit up. I thought I thought we were outside. Um, that was him when he was fighting that guy uh, for the for the title over in like England and Rev Pro or something. We didn't get anything from this place yet, though, right? Hang on. What do we need? There's some. There's gonna be something in there, right? Now I remember what you're talking about. Um. Let's see, let's see. Here, talk to him. Talk to him. Yeah, now I remember. I was like, that ain't his song. How dare you? How dare you insult my dude like that? That was funny, though, man. That crowd was super into it. I wish that AEW crowds would act like that during Dark. AEW crowds during Dark, they feel like... It, it feels like they are, like... Uh... Like they're obligated to be there. Like it's it's like they paid to be there and and they paid too much or something. I don't know.
to no books. And I guess we're doing the right thing, but but where is what I'm looking for here? I love how um you see this is something that Grand Theft Auto needs. The next Grand Theft Auto needs to have interiors like this. And and they could easily they have so much money. They could easily make it to where there's um just uh, what's it called? Uh, procedurally generated interiors? They just need to have stuff like that and just make it so that there's a... Uh, make it so that there is a... Uh, like a randomizer that makes it so certain houses have cool stuff in them that you could rob and steal and sell to people or, you know, make, make it so that there's something interesting about the houses. Not just, oh, there's interiors and they're blank and there's nothing to do. What's in here that I'm supposed to be finding? Uh, meow? Is there a hiding kitty? The hidden kitty. Oh, wait, maybe I can take that? No. about just that's the exit okay I see the exit but like what's that doing for me um, something in the washing machine clothes hanging up I don't know what I'm supposed to do here Rockstar made really nice places you can enter in Red Dead Redemption. Yeah, see that? That's what they need to do. Because cause that game, uh, Red Theft Auto V, it's a really good game. And, and I understand why they didn't go super hard on the interiors and stuff like that. Because the story already had such large-in-life characters and stuff. And <laughs> But I, I just, I'm worried about, oh, hey, okay, so you're going to make another game where you're not going to come out with a sequel for like 10 years or whatever? then I hope this time you make it worthwhile and not just uh, an online pay us pay us for shark card fest and and have you doing doing loop de loops with your with your rocket cars and stuff I hope that if you're gonna if you're not gonna come up with another game for for years and years that this one is actually gonna have a a, a, a cool thing for the rest of us to do who don't want to get online and race around all day. gonna break everything. How about this? How about this? Huh? What's in here? I don't see anything. That's right. I'll throw your box. Oh, I found it. I found it. There it is. It was in one of the boxes. Yeah, it sounds like Fiesta forever. There you go. I found it. It was in one of the, the boxes, so they wanted you to just go crazy and wreck everything to find it. <laughs> you saw that? This is my type of game. The, the, the solve for the puzzle, the solution for the puzzle was just go crazy and knock everything around. This one seems to belong to someone named Zabalsazar. All trace of organic life has disappeared except for what we call the Zerks. They seem to eat almost anything that moves and breed at an inconceivable inconceivable rate, as if being locked in the city wasn't hard enough. Let's find the other notebooks. Ah, the Zarks are probably those those robo uh robo rats. We got it, we got it. You know we're good. We did it guys, we did it. We the best. I solved the puzzle. All I had to do was get get frustrated and just knock everything over. That's my type of puzzle, man. I love that. Get frustrated and just knock everything over. Okay. Now what? This way? Meow. We got leaps in this game, man. Okay. Now, we just got to find one more. Is that it? Yeah, look. 
Oh, there's two of them there. Wait, 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 wait. Wait a minute. There's two of them there. Does that mean that's, that we already did this one, or is there two there? I see that one. That's blue. That's blue. Oh, look! All the way over there! All the way over there. Alright, how do we get over there? Meow. Ah. Meow. Yeah, all the way over here. I see it. Okay, how do we get there? This way? Aha! Uh -huh. Oh man, this place is cool. Look at this. Can we can we actually uh, watch TV right here? Yeah, yeah, watch TV. Yes, turn it on. Okay, watch the TV. Turn around. There we go. Watch TV. <laughs> this is extremely good television. Should get a trophy for this. Come on, where's my trophy at? Come on, this is good TV. Alright, you know what? I gotta go. Here, oh, maybe I step on it again and it does something good. Oh, look. We did find something. News. Breaking news. A robot with a... A robot with a sombrero on. Or a boat. No, a robot with a boat on its head. If, if there's a robot that turns into a boat, is it a rowboat? I swear I saw Monday Night Raw. <laughs> I swear I saw something like that. I, I saw like a logo that looked kind of like it. Is it a rowboat? It looks like we got a boat on his head. Breaking news. The first ever rowboat has been found. <laughs> Alright, hang on. Step on it again. Maybe we can watch Stranger Things. <laughs> What's this? Oh, up close and personal. Look at this sign. Weather. Oh, it's a weather report. Look at how cool this is. Is this not cool? Look at where we're at, man. We're both beneath a, a giant dome where the human race is like, I don't know, something happened and now there's robots that, that live here and we're a kitty with a with a robo vest and a best friend named B12. And we're looking at TV with a cup on top and a, and a cat. Look, there's a cat statue. I didn't even notice that. It's one of these cats. Remember, I was talking about this before. <laughs> one of these cats. It's one of these cats that does this. <laughs> oh. No, I caught a fly? Okay, here. Step on it one more time. What's this? Who wants to be a... Who wants to be a robo -nair? Oh, he's got all the... He's got all the questions right. Lucky cat? Yeah, the lucky cat. Man, I wish I knew what they were saying. Okay, one more time. What's this? Dude, they made mad shows. <laughs> it's the it's the shopping home network. The home shopping network with robots. The home botting network. What's this? Horror movie? It's a music video, I think. It's Temezi's music video. Yeah, it's a music. It's a. I think that what me meow's supposed to be. <laughs> really? <laughs> a lucky cat. But how many stations did they make? How did they make so many stations for this? Come on. Show me a real movie. What is this? That's creepy. Okay, that's where we started. Alright, we made it all the way back. We saw all the stations. 
Gotta go. No, no, no. Gotta go. No, gotta go. Meow. Okay, we made it. Aha, uh -huh, here we go. Party fiesta forever with a kitty. Translate. How to develop your artificial intelligence in order to be as creative as a real human. Volume 42. Uh oh. Yeah, I bet you. I bet you that's what happened, and that's why all the humans are gone. What's this? What did I find? Aww. Look, I found a little shelf. I found a little shelf to sleep on. Dude, you better not sleep on me. I'm sleeping on this shelf. Sleep on a shelf. I'm going to sleep on a shelf. Meow. Oh, you can meow in your sleep. Oh, that's cute. Alright, I'm out. Gotta go. That was cute, though. Hop down. That was cool. Maybe I could play this, uh, this song now. Ah, I found a sheet music. Yeah. Let's find out what that is. Uh, yeah. Kind of sounds like uh, it kind of sounded like Tomb Raider for a second there. What do we find? Six of eight? No, seven of eight. Here it is. What is it? He disappeared. That's mildly important information. <laughs> I would love to hear that played. Me too. <laughs> It's like a kind of okay song. It's not, not that great. But... Oh, okay. I already read that. I'm playing it. It goes like this. You guys like my rendition? It's, it's so good. Kevin Owens. <laughs> that's that's who's that's who's playing it. Did I break them? I did. I broke the the books. I broke the stack. Look at all this. Knocked this over too. So you hop on them, and when you hop off, they break. Like it breaks the whole pile. What about this pile? Can we hop up this pile? Come on, that's a super pile. Look, it goes all the way up there. I want to get up there. Here, let's try that. Ah! Look, it looks like we can do something up here. I guess not. Alright, alright, fine, jeez. Piano sounded mad. La 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 la. going up. Now? Skeleton. I see an extremely relevant skeleton. Translate this. Hey doc, I found the keys to your safe. You need to be more careful with these. Aha! It's not enough to bury your safe behind a bunch of books. Ooh, just the librarian. Okay. Is she straight from the clearance rack? I think she is. Draw a weird face on the wall. Okay, so the safe is behind a, a bunch of books. Meow. Bunch of books, bunch of books. Bunch of books. Is this the safe? No. 
Oh, well, maybe that's a postcard. No, we can't have it. But look, the postcard's right there, and then it's right on the screen. I wonder what that means. Smash the books. Smash the books. Smash the books. Wait a minute, I found it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, use the keys. What's in the safe? It's not safe, whatever it is. It's not safe, I'm taking it. The notebook, we got it. The last notebook. Yeah. Like I said, meow. This one seems to belong to someone named Doc. After weeks of research, I've combined a spectrometer with the powerful UV lamp. With this, we should be capable of warding off the Zerks on our way out. The Zerks. The initial attempt was explosive. I might have to test it under real conditions. Oh. There's also a note in this book. It says I found a design flaw in the transceiver, but I think I figured out how to fix it. Here's the equation. With this, we should be able to help Momo repair the transceiver. Yeah, let's get Momo. If it can, if it can communicate with the upper levels, that could be our way up. Nice. Let's show him what we found. Yeah, let's get back to Mo. Yeah. Let's go. Where's the way? There's a way out. This way, probably. I'm such a good kitty. Let's go. I wonder what made them think about, like, making it about a cat, you know? Why, why couldn't it be a dog or something? Meow. Let's get back to Momo. Momo, look! Hello, look! Hey, little cat, are you still looking for those useless notebooks? Come on, man, I found some good. Here, uh, Momo's notebook, Doc's notebook. Yeah, here we go. Oh, it belonged to Doc. He was really a huge nerd for electronics and stuff. He's always on the verge of a great discovery. Wait, what? Here, I'll show you something else. Here, I'll show you this. That's Zabaltazar's notebook, right? I never quite understood what he was talking about most of the time, but he was very wise. Okay, I'll show you Clementine. Hey, you actually found all my friend's notebooks? Yeah. Maybe dog is expansion. <laughs> Maybe it's DLC and it's dog, dog loadable content. DLC is the dog one. D stands for dog. <laughs> DLC. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> dog loadable content. DLC. Let's go. We should tell them that. Now that's funny. Next. What's that note? The transceiver can be repaired? This is incredible! What? That means we should be able to communicate outside of the slums. Sometimes, Zabaltazar. Doc, I'm sorry I doubted our cause. I promise you, I'll find a way to reach the surface. Yay! Dude, we made him happy again! Thank you, we might be able to find a way up. Now let's fix this piece of junk transceiver. Let's do it. Yay! Fix it up. Use a wrench. Et voila. It works. Come with me. Where are we going? Going over here. Look, he's hyped now. Hey, happy Momo. <laughs> Up there, see that building high above the others? Eh, I'm trying. Oh, wait, that? Yeah. If you install the transceiver at the very top of that tower, we should be able to communicate with the whole city. 
My friends might still be out there. If there's a way out, they'll know it. Gain new item, transceiver. Yay! You're only one small and quick enough. You're the only one small and quick enough to evade the Zerks. We need you, little outsider. Bring us to the sky. That's awesome, dude. Na na. We're the best. So we fell down a hole and we became like the savior of everybody. Kind of. I'm gonna deal with God to swap our places. <laughs> oh no. Wait. Wait, is that, is that it or is that it? I don't know which one is it. They look very... Uh, similar? How do we go? Here, let's talk to B12. Alright, let's put the transceiver all, all the way on top of that big building. Oh, there it is. Okay, that, that yellow one that looks like a... Like a mean... A mean, uh... French fry. What is it? Oh! Oh my goodness, that's uh, that's that's definitely real death. This is where stuff's gonna get bad, right? We're gonna we're gonna get hit with like a bunch of zerks all over us. It's zerk time. There's going to be Zerks all up on us now. Meow. Rooftops. Oh, look at this. I knew it. Meow. Meow. Where are my friends at? Here's the carpet. I wonder what this does. Does it actually, like, power you up or make... Oh, what? what's that? Oh, no. Is that Zerks? Yeah, that's mad Zerks. I knew it. How did I know it? Because I know game design. Okay, this is where, like, you you make the you make the player very hopeful, and then you hit them with something that's like what, and then it's like oh no! All right, run, jump, go. Meow to attract enemies. Why would I want to do that? Get off me! Get off me! Oh, get out of here! Okay. Oh no! They're all up on me. Uh, okay. There we go, okay. Ugh, they're trying to suck my blood, man. What are they doing to me? I, I think they are trying to suck my blood. No rain? Man, that was that like, crazy rain. Maybe that's the sequel to Heavy Rain is Crazy Rain. <laughs> it's about me. There we go. Look, this is where we're going. So the french fry, the, the angry french fry building. <laughs> Wait a minute, are they after me? No, 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 no. Okay, I thought they were after me. It sounded like they were after me. That angry french fry building. This is our quest. <laughs> this game's good. Have more rats. No pain. You got rats in your cave? This song is mad loud. It's all up in my eardrums. Uh, how do I how did I get rid of it last time? Oh, I press start. I think yeah. I think that's how. It mad loud. Here, I'm gonna turn this down a little bit. I like hearing all the little sounds that the cat makes and stuff like that, but um, like the music is very loud sometimes. I'm not liking the soundtrack, but I like one song. What song? Run, jump, go song? No, 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 stop! Don't get off me! Ah, no! Dude, they ate my, my... They ate my blood. Seems too dramatic. 
Maybe that's how cats are, though. Cats do seem very dramatic. You know? Cats seem dramatic. They're always like... <laughs> this part. This part is scary. We gotta get to the giant angry french fry. I think it was when you were trying to find the battery. Uh, where I had to find four batteries and plug them into the wall. Someone's supposed to be coming here. I think they want you to die here. They want you to feel the pain. Oh, maybe I can lead them over here and then... Yeah, okay. Yeah, and then and then I can jump up here and then they'll 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 come after me maybe. Can they jump up here? Here, jump up here and help me. Yeah. Okay, no 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 get off me. Oh come on. No, stop. Dude, what? Okay. Oh, okay, we don't have to do that. I thought I'd have to, like, make a lot of them get on one side of the, um, get on one side of the I-beam so it would, so it would, uh, duck down one direction and then I could run and jump off of it, like a ramp, and jump up onto the roof, but there's just a place I could just climb up. Oh god, here they come. Am I the best cat? I love how natural the, the design is as well. It's it's not like you're just platforming for the, it's not like platforming for the sake of platforming. It's like you're actually in a city and this is how you get to the roof if you were a cat. Look at that, that's nice. Oh, remember. Remember. Uh, I have to find it after if they have a soundtrack out already. Huh. Uh oh. It took it took Panda's uh uh badge away and such. I don't like it when it does that. This city is full of neon. It wasn't always this way. There used to be a there used to be strict energy caps, especially especially in the slums. Where people couldn't handle the constant darkness. One day someone lit up rainbow lamps, neon signs all over their house. That person was taken away and never seen again. But people saw hope and not long after everyone started putting lots of lights in their homes, there was nothing the oppressors could do. It was a way for people to see colors again, like the outside. I think it helped. Really? Huh? Oh, wait, Twitch, yeah. There it goes, there it goes. Yeah, like, it took your, like, badge and your, uh, and your sword away for, like, one, one message. Really weird. That's really cool, the memories and stuff. Where do I go? Do we go here? Uh-uh, you don't even go here. So what was this? Just a side quest? So a, a little side venture to tell you about it. I see. Jump. Nice. Whoa. Yo, it swings. Okay, that was nice. Do I have to do it again, maybe? There we go. <laughs> did it again come on these these rat dudes can't be over here they don't know about this don't go off a cliff 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 okay okay right there that's that's good enough that's good enough that's good enough okay hop up there you go squeak oh oh my goodness This is intense. You don't even go here. <laughs> Still here at the 
I had to wrestle a fitted sheet. Oh, jeez. Fitted sheets are crazy. Oh, don't go down there. What is this? Uh-oh. Look. It's the, it's the weird stuff that we saw when we were... Oh, wow. Oh, no. We're, we're in... We're in uh, Robo-Rat territory. 